Hello guys, I am back again, still updating you with the breaking trending news, what is going on in Nigeria. So wherever you are, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on your location at this time of the day. Um, I want to do this real quick. You can see on your screen. Tell DSS to stop floating court orders. Nam the Kano's lawyer, Jofo Och, President Buari. So, um, remember a few days ago, uh, we all know the story when Buari appeared on channels television. I think that was two days ago. Talking about entertaining some question that has to do uh, with the release of Nam the Kano IPOB leader. Uh, we all remember what Buari said, that he will not interfere with the court process, okay? Namdekano should defend himself that there will be no political solution, okay, to his release. So Ifan Ejofo is reacting to the statement of Buari. So according to Ifan Ejofo, he said that Buari was interfering with the judiciary over the case of IPOB leader. Ejofo said the DSS is directly reporting to Buari and he was aware that its operatives flood court orders concerning uh, issues on Namdi. Can we urge the president and DSS to desist from further interfering in the judicial process? Ejofo also said um, that um, time without numbers, the DSS has um, you know, flood court orders, a typical example uh, remember when um, the court asked the DSS to allow Nam Kanu freedom of worship, allow Nam Kanu to change his clothes. We all notice every time Nam Kanu comes to court, he will be using the same clothes. Okay, um, they should allow Nam Kanu change his clothes, allow him have access to, um, you know, delis. Not as if though not a fully free man, but they should give him that privilege. Okay. Uh, but the DSS, according to Ifan Ejof, or the DSS flood court orders, and they did not obey that court process. Okay, so that is a typical example. I remember when Ejofo talks about that. I also remember when Ejofo talks about starving Namdekanu in DSS detention, uh, detention. Okay, that is against the court order. So according to Ifan Jofo, okay, let me not waste your time. Let me quickly give you the statement. In quote, we visited our most revered clients as routinely guaranteed by the court protocol at the DSS. Interestingly, a number of engaging developments were discussed, including yesterday's stereotype, stereotype response by the President of Federal Republic of Nigeria on issues relating to political solution in our client's case. We were not one bit perturbed by his response, knowing fully well that they have no case against our client. What we are earnestly asking for is nothing else but for the executive arm of government led by the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria to desist from further interfering in the judicial process. We can authoritatively confirm to the world that the executive arm of the government of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, ably led by, pres by president, is gravely and effectively interfering in a client's judicial proceedings. To demonstrate good faith and impartiality, we beacon on the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria to first caution the DSS which answers solely to him to obey all court orders as it relates to the management of this case. A client, Oyendo Mazin Namdekanu, should not be detained in, 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 soli, in solitary confinement uh, in the custody of the um, same agency accusing him of committing sundry offenses and expect fair hearing. Hence, there is no independence of the judiciary as far as this case is concerned. And the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria is fully aware of this. If it is the position of the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria to allow fair hearing, he should follow up and ensure its reality most promptly. In view of the ongoing and incessant abduction and disappearance of Numerous innocent citizens in the Southeast, Oyendu, Mazi, Namdekanu, 
admonish all and sundry, particularly his followers and supporters, to be wary, vigilant, and, circum and circumspect at all times, particularly as it relates to calls and contacts from unknown persons. Okay, um, that is the statement of um, Barrister Ifani Ejofo reacting to uh, the statement of Buari, okay, when he said uh, he wants everything to, you know, he doesn't want to pass through uh, the judiciary, Namdi Kano should defend himself in court. And also, we remember some Igbo elite uh, visited Buari some time ago, that was last year, when Buari said um, he would consider a political solution uh, to the the release of Mazin Namdi Kano. So the one is Ndibu, they were even shocked to hear Buari made such statement that there will be no political solution. Even after when uh, Buari promised them that he will look into their case, okay, their request to release Nam Dikanu in a political way. But nevertheless, everybody knows that the North, okay, Buari will listen to the North more than the Southeast leaders. That the North, they are the people against the release of Nam Dikanu. According to Hanize, they will meet Buari again this year to explain to him or let him explain to them, okay, as if they don't even know who Buari is. Yes, the South is as if they don't know who Buari is. You don't expect the North. If you keep the North and keep the South East, um, Buari will listen to the North. So if the North, okay, the coalition, especially the coalition of Northern group, if the North, those elites in the North, the same people, remember they were the same people that uh, places a ransom of 100 million Naira for anybody, okay, that will bring Namdi Kanu alive. So do you think those same people will agree or will advise Buari to release Namdi Kanu? Yes. It's a very big question. So if the North advise Buari, don't release this man, and the Southeast elite, now meet Buari to release uh, Mazin Namdekanu. Who do you think Buari will listen to? It's a very big question. It, the, the, the reality is there. Okay, The truth must be told. Yes, Buari will listen to their people. That is just the truth. So Ohanize says they will be meeting Buari this year. Uh, let us uh, wait and see what will happen. Okay, But however, I wanted to update you on this. If you have anything to uh, contribute uh, put it down in the comment section below and please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your bell notification see you in another video